All right, here we go. I'm gonna do uh, chicken breast. And uh, I found this pan at all these. It's a big cast iron pan. Crofton makes it really nice. Works on the cooktop, so I love it. So I'm gonna go ahead and break it in with some chicken breast. And I bought it all these real big ones. Slide it in there. Fit perfectly. In the bottom, I got uh, gravy also from all these. It's a, uh, I don't know if you can see that or not, oven roasted chicken gravy. I never had it before, but uh, I gave it a little taste, and it, it, it tastes pretty good. So, in the pot it will go. Smother that up a little. That's already starting to boil. This is a good, this can be a good pan. Pot or pan, whatever you want to call it. In with that. We're just going to go ahead and throw some potatoes. These are little Dutch potatoes. You can buy it all these. You can probably get them anywhere. But we're going to go ahead and throw these in there. That's probably enough. I think that'd be enough. Yeah. Throw them all in there. Onions. Chop up some nice onions. Throw it in there and in there. That's probably good. And of course, the carrots. Got to put the carrots in there. Yeah, I know it's like a beef pot roast, but I'm going to go ahead and use chicken. Nothing wrong with that. A little bit more, maybe. We're going to go ahead and let that cook down. Throw some mushrooms in there. Now they have the mushrooms. These will cook down. And pretty good, I guess. We're going to go ahead and let that cook down. Throw some black pepper in there. Salt. All right, we're gonna cover her up. And we're gonna let her go. I'll show it to you when it's done. All right, we're just about halfway through it and I'm just going to open it up and let, let you see what it looks like. It's, it's still cooking down. It's got to cook down a little bit. But there you go. I'm going to turn it up. About 200. Chicken breasts are getting done. Almost. Nice gravy. Looking good. I did notice with this thing, it's got a nice flat bottom on it, but you gotta watch it, it'll slide right off of this thing. It'll slide right off of the cooker, so keep an eye on that and remember that. Okay, well there you go. There's the finished 
product. Fact, I cooked a little bit too long. I cooked it for about three hours. I don't have to go that long. But you got potatoes and carrots and chicken, and biscuits. One of these days, I'll, 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 I got a two, two ingredient biscuit maker. I can make. I'll, I'll show you how to make. Only takes two ingredients. One of these days, I'll show you how to do that. And there you go. Enjoy. Boo boy.